Hi, I'm Govinda. I'm a CEO founder of Smart Helio. Smart Helio is a software which detect and predict faults in a solar plant in real time. Today, I'll give you a demo of our software. Currently, you're seeing the home page. In the home page, you have a list of solar plants. It's on portfolio level. You are able to see that all the plants need some attention here. Now, let's click on one plant, which is in New Jersey, US. And then you are very quickly, you are on the fall table. This fall table have following information. It has a tag called early detection and you can have prediction. So the idea is that we can detect before or even predict it so that you are much more proactive uh, and you can take action accordingly. Then your equipment ID, then you have a date when the fault was created, then you have fault name, then you have losses, to, losses till date and the projection losses. This is very easy to visualize that which faults are really dangerous, where I have to act upon. Furthermore, on the right hand side, if you see there is a filter where you can easily go and navigate to the fault what you what bothering you. So for example, you want to go into high priority faults, which are basically PV module damage or a tracker issue gonna happen or something to do with inverters or combiner boxes or even string disconnect. So some these kind of things which can create heavy losses, they are more on the high severity. Now let's see that in the high severity we have a couple of faults including resort tracker issues. If you click on uh, tracker failure, so let's see, I want to click here, and it opens up something called diagnostic theater. So diagnostic theater is an extremely important feature which gives you um, more power and even to understand that how the curves are looking and is it really the tracker failure. So here you can easily see there's IV plots where you see that on this date there's something something is happening here. So where you can clearly see that the current has not been performing compared to other good performing uh, in, uh, inputs. But at the same time, it's been predicted that that looks like the um, uh, inverter is going to fail uh, looking at this behavior. So you can click on something called prediction plot and it's kind of give you a probability of the failure in the future. So it's uh, this another tool with this another graph which tells you when you have to go and fix your system. Let's go above, there is something called on-site instructions. So here, all the details are there which you saw on the table. But at the same time, if you believe that this information might, you know, the ground staff should do checks more. So what you can write it here, for example, here, check trackers uh, gearbox. And when you enter, this get updated and this is a ticket is generated which not only have autopilot recommendation but also your recommendation. You can easily close this one. Then you can go to something called you have you have selected those faults, you are happy, you can create something called site validation report. When you click here, all these things come, but you you if you want that a person should only focus on the inverters, so you can just go here and just click on inverters um, here. Here you see, and you can just put some reso also, or maybe you want to also check the tracker issues. Yeah, yeah. So you want someone to go and look at it. You can easily assign tickets to, let's say, you want to assign to Govi, and then you just say assign fault, and then the fault has been assigned to Govi, uh, and then Govi will take care of the faults. Thank you.